Welcome to part two of my Burnout 3 Let's Play. So, previously we beat this stupid freaking mission at the downtown area. It's a pain in the ass, but... Back for some more races. Another burning lab? Do I have to do this? What is the car? Oh, oh, oh. You want me to rage, so let's just do it. This is one thing that annoys me about this game. They they just shove so many burning laps in your face. You have to do these. I hate doing these burning laps. They're so annoying. It's like the hardest thing in the game. I don't know why. Whatever, let's do this. Come on, boost, boost! Drift. Oh man, I wonder how hard this mission will be. It's, it, since it's a burning lap, it's gonna be hard, but... But how hard? Oh! Turned at the wrong time. Come on, it's hurt. Just hurry. Yeah, there's gonna be a lot more burning laps coming up. And they progressively get harder and harder, so I'm going to rage a lot more. The hardest thing to do in this game is probably doing the World GP, the World Grand Prix, which is super hard. you got to use this crappy car, and it's not crappy, it's cool, it's fast and all. It's like one of those race cars, like real race cars. But when the wheels touch the wall, like if you hug the wall, you slow down and it crashes very easily, so that's going to be the hardest part in the game, but it's like one of the last missions to do. It's not the last mission, but gosh, it's hard. I'm so worried that I'll hit all these other cars. Oh shoot, watch out for the bus. If you hit a big vehicle like that at full speed, you explode. It's kind of funny. Oh, this is an easy burning lap. No problem. Was that hard? No, it wasn't. It was actually fairly easy. My camera's running out of battery, so after this part, we're gonna charge my freaking camera. And I'll be back with part three. But I think this is how it's gonna go. I'm just gonna record a buttload of episodes in one day of this game. And then I'll just like post them on the night after. But it just takes forever to upload these videos. So. Ooh! I, I get to unlock a car if I beat this. Is it the race one? Yeah. But there's a road rage. I wanna show the people this. Uh, let's do this. Is it the, yeah, it's the Toons Compact. Compact. So if I beat this race, I win that little bitch right there. Yeah. Let's do it! It's a compact car, so. It's not that fast, but that's fine, because later on you'll get to unlock these other cars and they are super awesome. But yeah, you start off with the compact cars and then you go to muscle cars and then coupe and then sports and then super and then the special series. They should have more. They should have like off-road or pegasi and ooh, motorcycles. They should have motorcycles in this game. And it's like if you crash your guy on your motorcycle like flies out. That would make a good burnout game. Ooh, I just got killer driller. Are you kidding me? Reverse! Wow, alright, well, we well we screwed up. Game had to ruin everything because, you know, it's a Treyarch game. Hey, that was probably, that was me who did that. Did you hear what he was talking about? What? Come on, give me a boost! I need more risks! Give me more biscuits! There. About the effa? Yeah, boost. Come on, give me it. I'm not getting these freaking boosts. Holy crap. 
Hahaha, dua empat way. How fast does this car go? 160. Whoa! The fastest car in the game is 209 miles per hour. Well, it's actually a tie between like five other cars, but you know, whatever. My favorite car in the game is the Euro Circuit Racer, but unlocking it, oh man, it is hard. Hard, hard. You don't have to like beat a race or anything. You have to get these takedown trophies. That's what you're called. You have to unlock them all. And in my profile where I beat the game, there's only two more I need to get, and they're like, get two trailer takedowns in a race, and the other one, two tram takedowns in a race. That's like $2 for a piece of toast. It's just ridiculous. I hate this part of the map with these goddamn pillars. Damn pillars. Yeah, I'm in first place now. Oh my gosh! This is annoying. Come on, give me boost! If I press the boost button when I don't have any boost ready, I like slow down. It's weird. It's kind of gay if you ask me. Oh shit! Oh my god! I'm like in first place and all of a sudden I crash. And I get in first place again and I crash right afterwards. Oh my gosh. This is fun. Who's that? Okay. This car is so slow, it's not even funny. Look how slow I'm going. It's ridiculous. I mean, I mean, I know it's a compact car, but damn, dude. I know I'm starting to cuss more in my videos. I just need to do that when I'm mad. Oh, you take me on the wrong side of the road, which is actually the right side. But the, I'm at the wrong side, like, like this side where I get boosts at for you know driving at that. Every time I die, it takes me to the. Wow, I'm four seconds ahead. Hey, you want? Hey, you want to know something? I hate this map. No! You motherfucker! Oh my gosh! You see, EA Games is just being the cock block because I'm like about to beat a race or something, and then the person who's in second place, like, let's say I'm in first place. Some, you know, some idiot is in second. Usually at the end of the game, for some reason, the second player, he like boosts. Right, right after me, and then he makes the finish line before me. EA Games does stuff like that all the time. And I have that happen to me a lot. And I just hate this map so much. I can't stand it. Oh, jeez. Ow, I did not touch that taxi. You saw that, guys. I didn't touch it. Stop taking me on that side of the road, I want this one. La, 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 la. Come on. Oh my god! This, why is this so hard? It's like the third race in the game. What the hell? This game's the ultimate Treyarch. I don't call them trolls, I call them Treyarch. I don't really believe in the thing of trolls. I think it's just more cyberbullying. Like, I hate it when people make those videos on YouTube, like, trolling? Oh, I'm trolling a little kid, like a little baby. It's like, wow, you're such a wise ass because you do that. It's like, stop thinking you're such a smart ass because you can trick and bully someone who only knows their ABCs. I mean, like, really, guys? Like, seriously, all these trolling videos, are, they're always, like, trolling little kids. It's like, how original, and you're so professional. Because anyone can troll a little kid. I mean, it's so easy. You know? And it's like, they just, you know, and some people don't even know how to troll. 
Like some people think shooting someone in Call of Duty is trolling. Like I would watch these stupid trolling videos to rant about them and like review them. And they're like, oh, trolling people on Call of Duty. And it's like a montage of someone of like the main guy shooting another person and the other guy who got shot is all, ah, really? You know, they do that. That is not trolling. I'm not a huge fan of Rage Comics, but I even I know what it is. And I just don't like trolling at all. It's stupid how people come up with their own vocabulary from Rage Comics because they get so much of a boner about it, so... It's like, oh, trolling in real life! And it's just gone crazy, no one knows how to do it, and it's just cyberbullying right now. Everyone does it with little kids. Because everyone's a retard! I almost made it to the finish line. I thought the I thought that wine truck was behind the finish line, but I still won anyway, so HA! Treyarch! But the point is, trolling is stupid, and don't do it. You'll just be an asshole. Ooh, two new cars unlocked! Yeah, sorry if I cuss in my videos. It's just no one's at my house, and... I don't know, sorry that I kinda do it. I just kinda need to do it. Cause I used to not do it, I try to keep it a family show, but... I'm growing up, and I just need, you know... If I rage or die in this game, I just want to go insane, so... I mean, you try playing this game yourself. See what happens. The Compact DX. Let's just call it the Deluxe, because I love that word. Deluxe. Sweet. First card takedown! Yeah, these these right here are the are the takedown trophies, and you're supposed to if you get all of these you unlock this really awesome car, it's my favorite car. Oh, but it's a pain to unlock. So now we're moving on to Europe. Wait, is there any more races to be done in America? Oh we got a GP. Wait, hang on, there's something in downtown I need to do. I just want to get this freaking map over with. Oh yeah, the road rage. Alright, this is what you kind of want to use for road rages. You want a heavy car. Like, find the heaviest car. This. That's fine. Let's just, let's use this. Alright. So, this is a road rage. This is my favorite. These are pretty easy, especially the beginner ones. Uh, and, you know, they're a lot of fun. So we're going to do this. Or we're going to do the GP if we don't unlock any other races. And then we'll move on to the Europe maps. Got it, got it, got it, got it. How much? Okay, we're not that much. Let's just do this road rage and then we'll call an episode. And I guess we'll do the GP after I, road, after I charge my camera. The GP, it's like a whole ton of races, it's like six races in one little event, so this fat ass in my way. So these road rages, what you do, you have to keep getting these takedowns, and that's all, that's what, all what it is. There's no first place or anything, it's just get as many takedowns as you can before the timer runs out or your car gets totally damaged to where it's not, doesn't work anymore. So that's basically what it is. Whoa, you see that? I, knew, I survived that. I just heard a major crash. Oh my gosh! Was that a gold medal I just got? I don't know. I just heard a wee wee. So I don't know, it sounded like a medal. Sound like a gold one because they're really high pitched. Whoa! Haha, ha, suck that pillar. I hate these stupid pillars in this part of the map. They're stupid. Get stupid! And those are signature takedowns right there. Pillar driller, that's like. They're like these certain kind of takedowns you get, and it's like all fancy and cool. Like, the cool way to do it, like, there's one where you make them. 
fall off a cliff. There's another one that crashes him into a trailer. You dumbass! Did you see that? The guy was totally raping me, and then he like pushed me into the freaking pillar. Damn it! Oh my god. Why do those people have their headlights on in the daytime? That's my excuse. Idiots put on their freaking... Their, their freaking, uh, freaking, uh, freaking, uh, 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 They use their headlights in the daytime. Uh, get off me! And it's kind of hard to get these takedowns. I don't know why they call this game takedown. It's so hard to do it. Like, you have no idea, these cars have extreme strength. Come on, kill this guy! It'd be awesome if I do. Oh no, I got damage critical, that means if I crash, I'm dead. Like that, but I still won anyway, so ha ha! Ew, new car unlocked! Yeah, you unlock a lot of cars in this game, so... Alright, we're gonna have to call this episode two. We'll be back with episode three. Yeah. Yeah, after this, I'm gonna have to charge my camera. Okay. Let's just see what cars we unlocked. Ooh, what is it called? The Assassin Compact? The Custom Compact. Oh, I got a signature takedown. Oh yeah, that's what I was talking about. But I thought I got that before. Oh yeah, and then I died and I had to restart. That's why. Pillar Driller. And there's a lot more. And if you get them all, if you, if you unlock like this really cool car. I never unlocked it yet, so. Five takedowns in a race? That's gonna be easy. All right. So I'll be back with episode three after I record this camera and just take a little break, like a little intermission. So, bye-bye and I bid you adieu.